Vanderbilt kicker Sarah Fuller makes history again as first woman to score points in Power 5 game. Vanderbilt kicker Sarah Fuller made history again Saturday when she kicked an extra point in the first half of the Commodores game against Tennessee, making her the first woman to score points in a Power 5 college football game. Fuller, a starting goalkeeper on the Commodores SEC Championship women's soccer team, joined the football program late last month amid COVID-19 issues and became the first woman to play in a Power 5 game by kicking the ball off on November 28 against Missouri. I just want to tell all the girls out there that you can do anything you set your mind to. You really can. If you have that mentality all the way through, you can do big things, Fuller said after the first game she played against Mizzou. I think it's amazing and incredible, Fuller said two weeks ago when it was determined she would dress and travel with Vanderbilt. But I'm also trying to separate that because I know this is a job I need to do, and I want to help the team out, and I want to do the best that I can. Placing that historical aspect aside just helps me focus in on what I need to do. I don't want to let them down in any way. It's an honor they called on me to be able to do this and help them out. Fuller joins Katie Nita and April Goss as the only women to play in an FBS game. Nita kicked two extra points for New Mexico against Texas State in 2003. She transferred to New Mexico from Colorado, where she did dress out but did not play in a game for the Buffaloes. Goss, who played at Kent State, kicked an extra point against Delaware State in 2015. Four other women, Willamette's Liz Heaton, Jacksonville State's Ashley Martin, West Alabama's Tanya Butler and Lebanon Valley's Brittany Ryan, have also kicked in college football games at various levels, ranging from NIA to FCS. Heaton became the first woman to score in a college football game in 1997. Fuller, a senior, helped Vanderbilt soccer win the SEC tournament last month to capture the program's first such title since 1994.